I read this section that Khloe Kardashian wrote about where she kind of talked a little bit about how blonde hair is where she feels her most confident, even when you guys went to the blonde hair color, which is my personal favorite of hers. I'm not going to lie. I thought she looked, I just, I love that hair color on her. Okay. I'm going to grab a book and show you that I texted Chloe to say, it's so funny that we're loving her hair color right now. Yeah. Yes. Yes. So look, I texted her this photo and I said, look, you are that, that color right now. So she is her true color and it looks so good on her. I'm Incredible. Obsessed. obsessed. Inc so the book works. Do you see what I mean? Her true color. You know, maybe your client is in love with the hair color that you just did, but then a few days there, later, they're like, mm, I kind of want to do something else. That happens quite a lot. So I, I already know how to deal with it. You just change it because hair color is super emotional. And if they're not happy with their hair color, it's not good. So you, you have to make your client happy. You have to, the customer is always right. And if I see an assistant, try to talk somebody out of how somebody feels, they'll say, are you sure I'm bright enough? Do you think that I am too dark or whatever? I pull the, ass the assistant's always like, no, 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 you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. And I'll say to them, if they're not happy with their hair, do you think by you trying to convince them that they'll go home and think that their hair is great? I just say, let's get it over with. Let's just add some more highlights or let's make it a little darker because you have to adjust to the client's feelings and what they like. 